Sometimes that means a refreshing adult beverage. With some wines comes a headache. KV's Amber Downing reports a Texas inventor is trying to keep the hangover out of your weekend. It's the weekend. Time to relax, maybe have a little vino. But with certain types, I'm looking at you red wine, people end up with a headache, flushed, or a hangover. Oh, it was about 10 years ago, I had to give up wine entirely. It was, uh, I'd wake up sometimes the next morning with headache and congestion, and that would be even after just a half a glass of wine, and I knew it wasn't from overconsumption. David Meadows is a doctor of biomedical engineering. He didn't want a little wine bossing him around. Being from a medical background, I kind of understood what these symptoms were, and I knew it was a histamine response. He invented the wand. It's uh, really a filter for wine. It works when you swirl it in a six ounce glass of wine for three minutes. Charged ions in the wand attract the two things that give people the most trouble with wine. It doesn't matter really whether it's a cheap wine or an expensive wine, they all have histamines and sulfite. Histamines come from the skin of the red grape and sulfites are used to give wines a longer shelf life. The challenge was being able to figure out how you can selectively remove the histamines and the sulfites without removing the good things. We tasted it, and yeah, the good things are still in there. Amber Downing, KVU News. Interesting, if you wanna try it out, uh, there it is available at HEB stores and Total Wine. Well, we wanna remind you, it is still alcohol, so don't overdo it. Even the wand can't help that headache or hang over the next day. So just be careful and don't drink and drive, please. I'll check your forecast when we come back.